Welcome to the Digital Literacy Student Orientation. This video will cover the main features of TechLink, useful resources available to students, Microsoft Office 365, and accessing Blackboard. We'll begin with the main features of TechLink. To access TechLink, first, navigate to ForsytheTech.edu, hover over Student Life, click on TechLink, and log in with your Forsyth Tech email and password. After logging in, you will be brought to the TechLink homepage. TechLink is your main information hub for all things Forsyth Tech. Here you'll find important updates, valuable resources, and useful information to help you succeed on your academic journey. First, let's take a look at announcements. Announcements are posts from the college that help to let you know what's going on around campus. You can find important deadlines and reminders of upcoming events and extracurricular activities posted here. You can click on an announcement to view more details about it. When you're finished, close the announcement to return to the TechLink homepage. On the left side of the TechLink homepage, you'll see a series of drop-down menus. These menus offer more information about our college services. Let's take a look under College Services. For this example, we're going to check out the library page. On this page, you can see several links along the top such as online resources, library tutorials, and library services. You can also view other services provided, reserve a study room, or check out their book club. Departments and services across campus have pages similar to this one. If you ever want to learn more about a service or view their contact information, look for their page under College Services. Next, on the TechLink homepage, we'll take a look at the Microsoft 365 App Launcher. As an enrolled student at Forsyth Tech, you have free access to Microsoft 365. To locate your Office 365 applications, click the Microsoft 365 App Launcher icon in the top left corner of the screen. In the App Launcher menu, some of the more frequently used applications will appear. If you are looking for another application, you can click the More Apps option. All of the Microsoft 365 applications that you have access to will appear in this list in alphabetical order. To access an application, simply click on it and it will open in a new tab. You also have the option of downloading Microsoft programs onto your personal device if you'd like. Just be sure to sign in with your Forsyth Tech credentials when using the programs. Next, we'll take a look at Quick Links. To name a few, the email access option will allow you to access your Forsyth Tech email account. My Forsyth Tech is where you can register for classes, view and accept your financial aid awards, and set up payment plans if needed. Navigate is used to make appointments with your advising team, digital literacy services, tutoring, and more. And Blackboard is where you will find your online courses. Most courses are set up in an online or hybrid model so it's important that you familiarize yourself with Blackboard. Let's take a closer look. Once you're in Blackboard, click the Courses tab to see a list of your classes. All newly enrolled students who are enrolled in or attended First Advising will be enrolled into the Student Online Success Blackboard course. This is a free, non-credit practice course provided by Digital Literacy Services to help students adjust to online learning. If you are not enrolled in the SOS course and would like to be, please contact Digital Literacy Services at the end of this video. The SOS course is designed to mimic what a typical course will look like for you. There are several modules that go over various topics, resources, and technologies that you'll encounter during your time here at Forsyth Tech. You'll find videos, presentations, practice assignments, and more that will help guide you on how to use Blackboard and other Forsyth Tech technologies. At the top of every Blackboard course, you'll find a course entry assignment like this one. The course entry assignment acts as an attendance marker and holds your place in the course. You must complete the course entry assignments by the posted due date, which is typically within the first few days of classes starting. Otherwise, you will be dropped from the class. Under that, you'll find a Start Here folder that includes important starting information from your instructor, such as their contact information and office hours, the course syllabus, a course schedule outlining the assignments you'll complete in the class, and textbook information if applicable. Next is the Student Information Hub folder, which contains links to various resources around campus. The Student Information Hub folder is similar to the College Services menu found on TechLink. Beyond that, your courses will have several modules that contain your course materials, readings, videos, and assignments. If you'd like to learn more about using Blackboard, Navigate, or any of the other resources discussed in this video, 
be sure to check out the Student Online Success course. For more assistance with using TechLink, Blackboard, Navigate, and more, Digital Literacy Services is here to support you. Walk-in support is available in the Academic Success Center located on the first floor of the Strickland Building on main campus. Virtual appointments are available via Navigate, or you can call Digital Literacy Services at 336-757-3716 or email dls at forsythetech.edu. We hope that this video was helpful and thank you for watching.